Hello YouTube, Badge here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install Halo Online. And I'm guessing if you're watching this video, you already know what Halo Online is, so I'm not going to waste my time explaining, I'm just going to get right into it. Okay, so there's going to be two downloads um, here, I'm actually going to show you that real quick. So um, you want to go to this page, both the links will be in the description, and uh, click right here. Once you click it, it will instantly download, and uh, also go here, and download Halo.zip. Um, Link will also be there, and then like just go to your downloads. And uh, for now, I'm just dragging them to my desktop. Anyways, um, so once we're on the desktop here, you just want to open Halo.zip, um, and then drag that to your desktop. And uh, if you don't have WinRAR or whatever, you know, just somehow get this Halo folder to your desktop. You can like just right click it and extract it or whatever. I think you can do that without any sort of 7-zipper or WinRAR, but if you don't have WinRAR, uh, if you're doing stuff like this on PC anyways, you're probably going to want Win WinRAR or 7-zip. It's going to make your life easier, so I recommend just searching it up on Google and you can find that pretty easily. Um, it's free, so don't worry about that. Anyways, so uh, yeah, we're just going to wait for this file to extract. Um, I haven't actually gotten to working yet myself, but I think I just figured out what I actually have to do, so, um, this is going to be on my live reaction, actually. I've gotten the game to run, but I haven't been able to play anything. Uh, for as far as I know right now, you can't actually play online. Um, people are trying to figure out how to host, like, um, LAN servers, kind of, like, a like, not an official server, like, host your own server and have friends connect to it. Uh, so people are trying to figure that out, but anyways, now we got this here. Um, now what we want to do is drag this in here, right? And then um, an easy way to do. I also have a um, just real quick. This is not required, but I actually have. Uh, game.cfg that is actually like ultra settings so I'm actually gonna put that in there um, so this is like an ultra settings CFG this is not required but if you want to game make your game look as fancy as possible I'll also um, put that in my Dropbox and let you guys download it anyways actually no I'll just put it in the description I'll just uh, copy and paste everything in the description for you guys okay anyways um, so yeah, what you wanna do is next thing. Oh yeah, I already did that. So yeah, just download, uh, just um, extract this in here, and then you're gonna make. Um, you can just launch. Um, I think you can just launch CMD, um, two CMDs. But I, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make like uh, actual CMD files to make it easier. So um, this is gonna be your launcher. So I just make a new text file and then. We're gonna go in here, and then I'm gonna go back to this form real quick and copy and paste what it was. Where is it? Okay, uh, I'll put this all in the description. But what we wanna do is copy that and paste it into there. Okay, and then go file, save as uh, all files, and then instead of .txt, put .cmd. I think .bat will also work. Let me just close that and then it'll create this uh, file right here and then we're gonna want to make another one um, text document and then we're just gonna use the example right there that's right here um, but pretty much this will be your command to launch the map and you just um, I'll show you in a second oh, wait we're gonna say this DXD right now and just do that um, and then pretty much you want to do halo free loader exe and then space and then um this is where you put the name of the map I'll probably end up making a different command prompt uh, file for each map in the game um, and you can go into the maps folder and find uh, the names of each maps but for example edge is s3d underscore edge I think this is a map that's specifically made for this game but I think they have guardian and Valhalla from Halo 3 in here as well but Okay, and then we're going to do CMD. 
Okay. Now what you're gonna do is when you click on this one, this is gonna um, launch the game. So let's do that. And then you're gonna see a Microsoft Infra. Uh, shit, my game just crashed. Uh, what? Hold on a second. Let me figure this out. <laughs> Okay, I haven't actually tried to get it to work yet, but I actually got so the game wouldn't crash. Uh, so yeah, don't use the CFG that I found. It actually doesn't work, so don't do anything with your CFG. I just restored the original one, so I'm just gonna leave it how it is. Anyways, so now, oh wait, I'm gonna, I gotta minimize the exploit. Sorry about that. Anyways, okay, so now, uh, do launcher CMD. Right? Okay, you'll see the Microsoft intro, bro. it might lag a little bit, uh, and then you'll see uh, that, and then that's the game intro. This is loading screen, I'm guessing that Russian right there says loading, right? And then uh, once you see the Halo online screen, so it's a black screen right now, it's obviously just kind of transitioning to the loading screen, or the, the main menu screen. Once you see that, alt tab out, and uh, do your map command prompt. Uh, or your, your map command prompt and here you go now here's it's loading uh, up here this is the first time I actually got it working and here we go we're in the game yeah here we go now <laughs> it's all in Russian I um, will look around and try to get it working in English hey you guys a uh, quick little thing I actually found out a way to download um, an English like translation I haven't actually tried it myself yet but what you want to do is download this it'll come I actually haven't also oh, um, I already downloaded it and uh, I'm just gonna put this in my, in my uh, desktop real quick what you want to do is, um, first of all, you're gonna just wanna like you can as, as I said you can do this anywhere. Um, I'm gonna do original. Uh, oops, I did a button. Um, but I'm just gonna name this folder origin. Oh, and then uh, just uh, you, what you're gonna do is just drag what uh, the exe you already had to another folder just to back it up, and then uh. This new download, you just want to open it, and there's an EXE in here, and uh, pretty much that um, is a modified version of the EXE that will make it play in English. So um, I'm just this is a quick thing I'm adding to the end of the video. Um, so yeah, link be, will be in the description. Um, I want to say thanks to um, Matt Dratt for getting me this link. Uh, so yeah, anyways. Uh, catch you guys next time. I uh, I just recorded a um, video going through all the maps, so uh, expect that as soon as I can get it rendered out. I'm doing that in like 1080p and 60fps, really high quality and stuff. So um, that'll take a while to get out, as well as this video itself might be a while. It might get a while to like render and stuff. So um, it might be a while until it actually gets here on YouTube, but uh, expect that as soon as I can. Okay. Anyways. Talk to you guys later.